And this only has two in it because Michaela already has her own coloring set, which she got for her birthday. I have three, actually. You have three. Yeah. Yeah, she has three <laughs> coloring sets. So why did I spend money buying this? Why didn't you just give one, give two to your sisters? They're all different colors. welcome back to another video today I'm doing a homeschool organization video for you guys um, this is something I've been meaning to do I've had our homeschooling stuff on the upstairs stored in like a little organization bin it's actually really cute you guys will get to see it but it's just not what I want and it's not thoroughly organized so I finally just pulled the plug and said, I'm gonna go ahead and do it, though I have not found the exact organization system that I've been looking for. So in the midst of doing this all, I decided to just make a little video on it and just show you guys what I'm doing. And in the midst of it all, I will also give you guys a little bit of a rundown, showing you little various curriculum things that we do use in our homeschooling life. So I hope you enjoy this video and stay tuned for more. I currently, I have this shelf and it was sitting in the garage for the longest time. Aaron and I will be painting it, but for now, because school has started, we're a little bit behind in getting things organized. So I'm just trying to do this quick and I'm going to do a quick organization um, vlog. This stuff on the top, these are some things that we use to assist us in homeschooling, like just casual days when we will, in between work, where we just want to have some good read to just educate ourselves. These are good books to have. And I have done, if you guys want me to show more an in, in-depth review on some of these books, I can. And they're the DK books. Overall, they're really good. We also have things like Silly Starters and Story Starters. We've had some of these for a while, and then we've also added a couple over the years. These never get old because it just it just prompts the kids and gives them like story ideas so they can flip different cards. But anyway, so whole, that's besides the point. Um, we're going to be painting this, but for now, I'm trying to organize this little shelf. I feel like it doesn't look entirely bad. I feel like inside this space... It doesn't look too bad over there. Ignore the mess on the table. But it doesn't look too bad over there because I don't know, I'm trying to, I need to find a long cabinet in the background here. But for now, I'm just gonna use this. So I have to go through all of these and organize them and put them on this shelf. Whatever, whatever is not being used is gonna go downstairs and what is being used will stay up here. Guys, this is what I had storing my my books in at the bottom, but this is going to be my Costco bag that should be in the back of the trunk. So I'm going to get all this stuff out of it, and then I am going to knock it out outside and put it in the trunk where it can be used. The entire bin from down below there, it is now sitting empty on the floor as you saw before. And so all these things that we emptied out of it, we have to take out and we're sorting them into a pile for each child. And then we are basically assessing what we want to keep. Here's my jug of water. I've been doing very poorly today because I have yet to consume not even half of this bottle, y'all. So that is not good. <laughs> I have my work cut out for me for the, before the end of the day. Because I'm going to have a party. I'm going to have a P16. You rude. No, like, I said, you already had the P16. <laughs> I know, I probably had. Uh, in the midst of discovering that, that pile, we found this. This is an art that Charlotte did in our homeschooling co op. All the girls are really great um, artists, but I really like this because I'm like, Fall is here, my favorite season, so that's why it's yeah. calling me because it's fall time. So I'm hoping to get a, 
um, frame for this to put it up on the wall over there somewhere. I think it's gonna look really pretty. And then I've got this calendar. So if y'all have been following our channel for a long time, you would have known that I definitely, I love this mom calendar from Costco. I don't even know if it's called the mom, is it? Ultimate it's called, family calendar. Yeah, it's it's called ultimate. ultimate Family yeah. Calendar. This is for 2019. I get it every single year to put on our, ca our um, fridge. The magnet comes at the back and I always divide it into four sections and put it in each corner. That way the whole um, calendar can sit securely on the fridge without shifting around or flapping or anything like that. So I really like it because it's, the, the boxes are huge. It's enough for me to write in all those spaces to fill out our calendar for the month. I'm not going to lie, last year I feel like I kind of slacked. Like I, Because I was using my own personal planner, I didn't exactly utilize this as much, but I need to because it's the only thing that keeps us sane. Right, oh, ladies. 100 stickers. Oh, wait, it keeps us Mommy. sane? It keeps wait. us sane because Mommy. we're, oh, we're calendar, organized. Okay, yeah. yes. oh, we're going to be so excited to use these oh, stickers every single sure. day. Yeah. We're going to be putting them all over the calendar. Yeah, they come with a lot of nice stickers. Oh, I forgot to show that. We even thing. have movie night for Fridays. Yes, and we have family movie night. So and activities. Should, the girls. I'm going to have the girls sit down maybe at the end of this video, and they'll probably go ahead and set it up for certain things that we know that we have for sure, such as family night, which is a movie night. And I'm look, it even has. And it doesn't, it's not always a movie. It could be a series, but it is like TV night for us. So, um, yeah. Yeah, like once upon a time. <laughs> we haven't watched that in a while because tell them why. Season seven comes out in this month sometime. What? Once upon a time? Yeah. Are you there on season, they have, there's a season seven? Yeah. That's ridiculous. I follow what comes out in Netflix. Yeah, whatever. Peace Dragon is also leaving this month, apparently. Good for it. Also, okay, month? and um, leaving next so anyways, that is what's up. Oh, I think in the middle of this, in the midst of it all, let me go ahead. While we're in this video, I might as well go ahead and show you some of our school supplies that we got. We still need to pick up a ton of stuff. We need to pick up our notebooks, and I missed the sale because Staples had the notebooks for apparently... Um, oh, it was 10 cents, which I bought. If you guys followed my video, you would have seen that I bought it there a while back as well for 10 cents. And I bought a ton, so I didn't need to buy any for years, but I'm running out. So Staples had that. I missed that, but we need to get uh, that. We bought this, this 52 uh, coloring set. And this only has two in it because Michaela already has her own coloring set, which she got for her birthday. I have three, actually. You have three. Yeah. Yeah, she has three coloring sets. So why did I spend money buying this? Why didn't you just give one, give two to your sisters? They're all different colors. True. One of the sets is only dark and like shading colors, and then the other is more vibrant. And then one of them is really useless. It just came with a coloring book that was really cute that I never actually got to color. And yeah, I just have the coloring set, and they don't work very well. <laughs> Um, so the two that I anyways, then we also picked up this 15 Math Essentials. You guys would have seen it at, we were at Costco. We, when we were at Costco, we picked this up. It has, um, these were, I think, how much was this one? $9.99 or $14.99? It may have been, I think it was $14.99. It may have been $14.99, and I think this was $10. So that was, those are great deals. And guess what, Gabrielle? We guess what you get inside? Pencil sharpeners. Oh, her favorite. Yeah, her, your favorite, exactly. <laughs> Look, Mom, what else Gabrielle loves to sharpen her pencils down to nubs. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, watch this. Poe poppers! Yeah, they have this, so they're going to play this at some point, but we just need to get our house organized. Oh, let me show you the shelf. Enough with the talking, Sarah, you say? I'm almost done, y'all. I'm almost done. Don't come for me. Is she okay? Yeah. Don't? Where are people? Um, Joey, that's enough water, and she went all crazy, crazy. at me. She's like, no, I want water. She wanted more water? We have all these pencil crayons, so I mean, honestly, if you ask me why we bought that, it, it is a big of, bit of a waste, but I think the kids wanted to have their own individual pouches, maybe for when we travel, even, even though we could have just traveled with all of these. Gabriel, stop that. Even though we could have traveled with all of these. So why why did we buy pencil crayons? Because it had pencil cases and... What a waste. <laughs> Wouldn't you rather that $10 for like pizza night or something fun? 
Oh, oh why those? do you not say that? You're gonna wait, these are Yeah, why do we waste money buying more? That's anyways, anyways um, they have their markers. Mm -hmm. We're trying to just find places for these. So this is what I've done so far to the bookshelf. <laughs> is she okay? Yeah. yeah, I think so. It's the water. Uh... Zozo? So are you going crazy with the water? No more. <coughs> you okay? Yes. Okay. Oh, she's okay. I think you're good. <laughs> wow. And you made a mess. Your puff puffs are going to be melted by the time you, you consume them. I'm just going to clean up the yeah, water. Yeah, yeah. Wipe whenever, it really quick. Thank whenever you. she drinks water, she just like pours like, everywhere. You know, from her mouth. I'm only giving her a few at a time. You can do this as well. Just don't give her a whole. A whole. Yeah, because she's like stuffing her face. Anyways, guys, come on, let's go. Dad's almost home, okay? Gabrielle, dad's going to be here in about 20 minutes, and he does not want to come home and see the place looking like this. Not that he would care, anyways, well, but we have still. An excuse. No, we don't. <laughs> I like my house to be clean, thank you. Mommy, okay. here, this is yours. So this so, is a Like I was saying, guys, this is the shelf so far. I have yet to organize the top, but I did have this little box. I think, think I got this at a garage sale a long time ago. It's just a little box. I don't even know the dimensions. Sorry, I'm blocking the light, but it's what? Perfect for storing stuff. So they're each going to store their tablets in here. Should be able to keep their three tablets, pencil, crayons. We are, and we've yet to go through these to know exactly what we're going to keep. If you're a homeschooling mom or homeschooling parent of any kind, you know what it's like having like just pencil, crayons and stuff that's some of it may not be good anymore just because, you know, we have we use them like that over the years. Anyways, we also have that. That was easy. That that was easy button. We like to use that for fun in between our work at times. But here we are. So as you guys can see, some of the things we have on this shelf. The thesaurus, which we've already utilized so many times since school started. We have the uh, Find It Fast in the Bible. This is really good for devotions. We have the Devos for Girls, which we haven't done this year yet. I mean, we just started. So school just started like two days ago. We've got Grammar Girl, which we really like. Statistics for people who think they hate statistics. This is for me because I have to redo statistics. As you guys know, I did not pass that course um also we've got these dk books that i was telling you guys about i found the others we've got it for english math and study skills which is really really good especially for michaela in high school now we have it for signs and this is actually a, the, another make this one here sorry you can't see my finger <laughs> but this one is how science works and then this one is how to be good at science tech and i guess technology and engineering and aaron was intrigued to get this one because obviously he's an engineer so got that then I have those story starters over here um, we also have these really cool reasoning and logics oh my oh wow <laughs> she... oh wow wow oh wow <laughs> yeah we have these reasoning and logic um, cards we've gone through a ton of these so I'm not sure where we are what number and then we also have this one It's called reading between the lines so yeah that's there and then we've got some of our other books here that we're using um guys I'm, I'm still waiting on curriculum and i still have to pick up stuff so this is just some of the stuff that i gotta pick up clear out some more of this and then we've got stuff down here as well so it's not fully organized but but it just cleared up my pathway and just gave us a space to work. I'm not sure where we're going to store our individual things. I'm going to have to come up with another idea. Maybe when I clear this up, we can find a space. Okay, this or maybe on top here to somewhere. So, this is stuff that we're keeping but has no real relation to schoolwork. Surprise can stay up here. Maybe it. Polly Pocket skirt, but you have no idea why it's in your school function. Huh? Said so that one random Polly Pocket. Hi guys, thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to join the tribe. Subscribe, subscribe. <laughs>